lot, a lot of people. Like I said, there's at least just, you know, in the last couple of days, the, there were six or seven people, if not more, that were just sending you these attacks. These death, the death magic and self attacks, it's hexes, spells, whatever, voodoo, witchcraft, whatever they were doing in this devilish energy. They're weak, though. It's going right back to them times ten, though. I mean, the magic wasn't weak. It's just they're, you know, you're just way too powerful for it. But so when it comes back to them, it's actually, it's actually pretty strong stuff they sent you. But you're just way too protected. You're, you're, so, you know what I mean? And they're weak. They use up all their energy doing all this shit. And they're getting weaker and weaker because they've been, they're under this, you know, they're attacking themselves this whole time, morons. So they're already weakened down now. And what they casted out to you was something strong. It was something very strong, very powerful. And it's coming back to them times 10. <laughs> so not some people ain't going to be making it like to say the least. So have fun with that, idiots. They thought they were slick. Because they know they're, they know you're powerful. So they tried to conjure up. So they, they thought if they, got, if they grouped more of them together and all put their energy in. No, they found out real quick. Fuck no. Because it was chaos magic. It was death magic. It was a lot of stuff they did. It. They did a lot. They And what they conjured up was something dark something it was very powerful i'm not gonna i'm not gonna hold you it was powerful but you're just way but compared to you you're too, way more powerful than them and just think about it it took six or seven if not more of them to do this to you and you're still standing <laughs> like nothing even touched you <laughs> and these people are like losing arms and like <laughs> walking around with like one finger and shit <laughs> fucking retards <laughs> idiots mm -hmm. and they're not they're not going to be making this i'm telling you a lot of people are going to be passing away but there's still going to be somebody telling, coming in with the truth to be able to survive, to be able to... Ooh, shit. Bitch, ew. I just heard... Mm, tell a friend. They're making sure somebody survives so they, they, to tell. To tell a story. When I tell you, these people are living in hell right now. They're living in hell right now. And it's because of their own doing. That's what they sent out to you. <laughs> so they just attack themselves, idiots. Really dumb. They're hella nervous. They're hella nervous. Because you, you're keeping your sword up. And they're trying to come back to finish the job. And they're under heavy judgment. Why? Because you have your sword up and you walked away. And you're not allowing them back. Because you're listening. You're being very obedient. And because of that, you're getting your justice. And they see your single, self-sufficient, independent. You're like your own boss. And whatever this father figure or uncle figure, whoever this is, masculine energy or this workplace that's holding on to this inheritance that belongs to you, it's protected what they stole from you. And now they can't sleep at night. They're boohoo crying because they're losing jobs, they're losing opportunities, they're getting kicked out. They could have got kicked out of a house that belongs to you. Um, their eyes, you know, keep your eyes on your goals because your goals are going to lead you to your union, Okay. And these idiots are going to prison. And you're manifesting your justice and everything else. These people ain't too smart, let me just tell you. Guys, can we please hit the, get the likes up, please, and thank you. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and Loved Ones of Past. Damn, okay. Y'all seen how I hit those, that two of cups, right? Your ex is getting some, like, when I tell you your ex is under fucking spiritual attack, and it's because of this, what they sent to you, they're, they're fucking done for, I'm telling you right now, but they're still, they're telling the justice system everything, they're smiling in your face, stabbing you in the back, all the illusions, everything else, your divine counterpart, your twin flame now knows too, the, um, the truth about how the people, you know, because with twin flames, you're mirroring souls, so everything that's happening to you, they're going through similar situations, they're finding out the, the all the illusions and everything else about the people that were smiling in their face, stabbing them in the back too, and how they're aligning them about you, there's also somebody in the justice system, it's your ex, that's also smiling in these people's faces, either in your, it's either your ex doing it, or there's somebody in your ex's face doing it to them too, and it's coming back, you know, and they're in the justice system, telling justice to them everything. And I feel like it's a justice system, actually, that's smiling in their face. Can't really step them in the back. Because, like, like I said, your ex was planning on framing you. He was working with the feds trying to get you framed. But the justice system knows the truth, 1 million percent truth about your your ex. And they're just, their feds are using your ex up because your ex was also setting other people up. 
so the, your the feds needed your ex to um to set up the other people and now they're smiling in your ex's face and now with the feds you can't lie to the feds if you lie to the feds they they'll rail you they'll fucking rail you and that's exactly what's happening um they know that your ex was trying to frame you and now they're smiling in in your ex's face getting ready to stab them in the, stab them in the back <laughs> heavily all right you're getting some sort of quick communication about this about some sort of painful permanent ending about about this inheritance about that's coming back to you and possibly your fucking ex um could be passing away or somebody's passing away you're also getting quick communication about you coming into union with your divine counterpart your twin flame it's got these people in established energy heavily burdened because they know your ships are coming in which is your justice and your one million percent truth and clarity your closure and everything and you getting your your inheritance back and your divine counterpart your twin flame and they know your ex knows that they're going to prison because i feel like i feel like they already told them they already know i feel like they're just keeping hush hush because they're now they know that they're going to prison for all this though so they're telling the justice some of the one million percent in source truth they already know what's happening they don't know what's going on they already got this quick communication they're just now taking pleas or whatever and still you know whatever i don't fucking know you're getting ultimate wish fulfillment though okay because they've been exposed and they're gonna have nothing but complete happiness joy abundance okay and you when it comes to this court case when it comes to this this inheritance that was stolen from you it's going you're going to have the best possible outcome um that you could ever imagine it's going to make you extremely happy and it's going to put you into this king of pentacles energy whether you're masculine or feminine all right now these people want to apologize to you because they know that you're heavily protected for they want to um try to apologize and now protect you from blocking you know or or from this leo that you have blocked off because they know how powerful and strong you are or there could be a leo that's getting locked up that's in jail or, or about to get their deep emotional pain about you rapidly progressing you're getting like some sort of like spiritual upgrades okay they're trying to block this um but it's not happening they're trying to block your gifts but that's not they're dumb fucking idiots I'm like you're dumb <laughs> stupid they want idiots low vibrational idiots they're under heavy judgment man because they're fucking with an earth angel you're getting quick communication about this about your ex and anybody else that's smiling in the face stabbing you in the back you're right out somebody's passed away people are passing away and people are going to um I just heard, listen, Linda, listen. Someone's name could be Linda. It could be your name or somebody involved. Or somebody needs to listen. They should have listened to you. They should have listened to their guidance, not to fuck with you. And we have another 10-10, another completion, another end of a cycle. And so when I tell you it's over, it's over, I mean, it's done. It's a wrap. You're getting a message. Or they got the message that you are a fucking power couple and you two are not to be messed with. Because I'm telling you, they weren't just attacking you. They were attacking your twin flame, too. They want to come in and invest in you now and play in a whole new world. With They're playing a whole new world with you in it. God's blowing his torn. Like, look, he's, th he's blowing a trumpet on these fools. You're getting some sort of quick communication about this Ace of Cups. Your cup being overflowing with love. And it's your King of Cups. Then they are an Earth Angel. It's your Twin Flame. That's exactly what this is. It's a Twin Flame here. Everything's being balanced out. All the people are smiling in your face, happening in the back. And then they got all these people fighting about this. Your, your twin knows who you are. They're not losing out. They're like, no, absolutely not. They want to be with you. And you have like possibly two of your exes that are under heavy judgment that are going the fuck down they're trying to block this okay it could be a leo but you're protected your union's protected yeah some about a house they're heavily burdened about how about a house 
they try to send some sort of death magic. They're, they're sending monitoring spirits to you, too, to your home. It's, they're fucking idiots. Something about, like I told you, like a house or some sort of like a house fire or something that you're getting justice for. Or this is what's going to happen to them. Someone's going to end up passing away in a house or, they, I don't know, something about a house. I'm telling you, I'm picking up like on a house fire or something like, or someone's going to like 5150 by jumping out like of a building or something. That's, or like some, someone's going to pass away in a house or something happened to a house, a house fire or something. Or they're like a natural disaster is going to come out and wipe somebody's house out or something. Someone's going to pass away it's from this death spell um, backfire. There could have been a house that was stolen from you in this inheritance as well that you're getting back. But somebody's house is haunted, and it's because of what they conjured up to, to send to you. It could be this couple that's been attacking you, that's been working with karmic family and um, your ex and everybody else. But whatever about some about a house is being balanced out. If they burnt your house down or did some damages or stole a house from you or did any damages to this house, if they stole the house and then sold it or damaged it, everything's being balanced out. They're going to have to pay you for that house and they're going to have to pay you top fucking dollar for that house. Plus, like, you know, um, pain and suffering, everything else. And if they burnt your house down or whatever, I can definitely resonate very heavily with that, you piece of shit. Listen, Linda, listen. I know you fucking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, that's being balanced out too. The authorities already know about this. They know that it was a a um an attempt to take your life as well. They know about this. They've been known about this. And your ex is telling one of them about this too. Yeah, yeah, you're a star. You're a healer. Okay, they got that message. <laughs> and I'm telling you, really, you got these people <laughs> from your past that are going to try <laughs> and like ask you they're going to try and pay you to pray for them and to heal them because they know that you're getting this passionate new beginnings also you have like a child all right you're getting some sort of raise or proposal too all right but there's also some sort of there's like a child maybe you lost contact with or somebody you knew since you were a child but like you lost contact with or something like that um you're coming into union and you're going to have a passionate new beginning it's not nothing negative okay it's, it's a good energy it's either like maybe your child went to college or i don't know another parent or or a grandparent or something happened to this child um like where they somebody else got custody of them um or something like that they, they brainwashed them or whatever it was you're getting passionate new beginnings okay they know you they're, they're gonna know the truth god's making sure the truth is um comes out about that or if it's like somebody that you knew since a childhood and they just lost you lost contact with maybe i don't know you just grew up you know from school you just moved away you lost contact but they're not karmic this is not a karmic energy that i'm picking up on you're they're coming back into union with this child or this person that you knew since a child or it could even be like a family member i mean i don't know what it is it could be it could be like a family member maybe they moved into another state or something you're coming back into union okay okay guys can we get the likes up please and thank you all right holy spirit divine spirit angels ancestors loved ones passed away what is the outcome of the situation please and thank you Thank you. Queen of Cups. There's the king. There's the queen. Now your ex is looking at you as like, they, they feel stupid as fuck. The, well, the justice system sees that you are a very loving, nurturing, caring person, whether you're masculine or feminine. All right. And now your ex is like butthurt because they wish they see you for who you truly are. They wish they would have played their cards wrong. I mean, like played it differently. They didn't play it the way that they did. Because um, they know that you're, excuse me, confirmation. They know that the um, that you're coming into union, union with your divine counterpart, whether you're masculine or feminine, put the roles where they fit. I'm just reading the cards the way that it's being said, but it could be opposite. Everybody has both energies, you know what I mean? And it's a collective reading, so, you know, take what resonates, leave the rest. But, um, yeah. They're watching you. They're watching you, they're seeing you healed. And they see, and like I said, these people from your past, okay? 
they've seen ever since you healed, you prayed up. You're also helping people change, go from the dark to the light, which is absolutely beautiful. They're starting to to let people like you know see that because they're, they're watching you they see how you heal they want to know how you did it. it's because of god hello it's the only way it's because of god it's because of jesus all right and they've seen that ever since you you cut these scumbags off and you you went in or you you know you got closer to god you healed and your life's been a generous blessing ever since then and you're you're about to be happy like a happy home happy family everything because it's a completion end of a cycle and these people are in grief pains or agony because they're caught this whole group called cup and secret society that you left that you walked away from so now but there's you're they're starting you're making people a believer um yellow wolves make make me a believer is playing in my head right now um amazing song i love that song i love that video too um i love every song from your love but they're seeing that so now you're inspiring other people to stop from their fucking evil ways and to find god to heal and because they see that yeah that's what you did and look ever since you did this you've been having generous blessings of course because that's what your gifts is and some people, if, you know, they think that it's too late, it's not, but there's a confirmation. But, thank you, Clyde. But, you see, there's a difference. You you can't be thinking, because God knows your, your what your thoughts are, okay? What, and everything is intentions. You can't be out here like, oh, because I know there's people out here thinking they can do that, like that Leo be thinking that dumb shit. Thinking that, oh, well, they can go do whatever, all this devilish shit uh, up until the very last second then right the last second and when it's time to meet you know god um and you're gonna be like oh no 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 i believe in you no it doesn't work like that because god knows that's what your intentions are but if you have been doing this devilish shit and you can stop but it's it, but like you like once you realize oh my god like god really truly is real and you know if you you know what i'm saying and you stop if from your evil ways you find god you do the right thing you have to right your wrong stop doing this evil shit and turn to god turn to jesus um and accept him and repent repent from your sins and accept him as your lord and savior um and you know what i mean um then yes you you can you can change you can be saved and god uses you'll be surprised who god uses he uses people like that like some people think that it's too late it's not too late but you have to change your life around you have to stop you know just think about it. like god likes to use people like that to change as a testimony to show his faith that as a, you know what i mean and to show his greatness that, that to show his you know love and his, his mercy and everything so you know what I'm saying? It can be done, but if you think that you're going to be out here doing all this devilish shit and just think that at the very last second, you can know God knows that's your, that's your intentions. So I feel like maybe like these people, you're starting to show them the right way and they're starting to take your guidance and they're seeing God's work in you because obviously confirmation thank you god you, you obviously god is very much so real because they know what they've been doing to you they know what they've been sending out to you they know what you've been through and they know that the only way that it's possible that you are still here today is because of god it is the only reason and they fucking know it so you're inspiring people from um to stop doing their evil you know their evil stuff and stop this devilish energy and to to change their ways to find god and to um to turn their life around which is absolutely beautiful and it's it's not too late you know um and god will like all you have to do is repent you repent you have to find god repent from your sins even if you sold your soul you know you just take it up with god and you just need to stop don't you can't think that oh well i'll just wait until you end. No, god knows your everything is intentions everything is intentions he knows your thoughts before you do so that's not gonna work but if you if you sold your soul you're in a, you know you you fell for the devil's bullshit it's not too late you you can change you can get your soul back you can because first of all it wasn't even your soul to get rid of it was god so um you know take it up with god you you can get it back all right it's not too late but you have to stop you have to stop from your evil ways but they're watching you they see you as this loving nurturing caring person they see they know that you're coming into you thank you yeah and you're rapidly progressing and these assholes are going to prison <laughs> someone's going to fucking prison for sure people are getting locked up you might somebody might already be in jail
And this is also somebody, it's a hearse coming for somebody too. Someone's passing away. For sure. Anybody that worked together. Also, like, this could be your, 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 your divine counterpart coming in, your twin flame coming, like, in transit, coming to you. But you are right. Like, all right, wait. So you're connected in the 5D already, okay? You're already connected in the 5D. Everything has to happen in the 5D first, and then it trickles down into the 3D. You are already communicating everything in the 5D. You're rapidly progressing, all right? And they're coming in. They're coming into union with you. They want to work with you. And I feel like you're you're also, you're meeting them because through your your um your purpose, whatever you're doing in your purpose, but your spiritual gifts, they're already watching you if you have like a YouTube or if you have a platform, if you have a um social media or whatever, they're already watching. I feel like that's how you're going or if you have like a business or a church or whatever it is that you have, whatever you're doing to your spiritual gifts, whatever you're doing in your purpose, that's how you're meeting them. And I feel like they're already watching you. And you're having there's someone trying to end your purpose that's not working, okay? You're having some sort of rebirth or whatever. Upgrades and stuff. Damn, okay. And look, yeah. It's your emperor. It or you you know what I mean? And you're you're properly progressing what you're doing for work in your um and it's protected you're protecting a seven of wands. And whatever they're holding on to is protecting now. Also your your twin flame is holding on to you and only you and they're also these are protecting each other in the five day. We have four four we have four, four, four. Actually, look at that, beautiful. And then seven, seven, seven. All right, they're 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 stuck on you. Um, and your ex tried to sacrifice you. We already know that they're a fucking loser. Uh, but they're now grief, pants or agony because they are because you're protected. You're coming into union, and um, they try to sacrifice you. It's not gonna work. So and now the devil's like, well, hmm, where's my soul at? Um, well, they can't. They're not bringing the devil your soul. So it's their soul. Okay, it's a completion. It's the end of a cycle. It's a case closer here. You're about to have this happy home, happy family. This could be karmic family too. People that you consider to be family. It's over. All right for them. Whoever came up against you or people that you consider to be family, you're getting this major blessing. We're going to be able to bless the pockets of other people. Um, you healed from whatever this is. And your ex sees that. And all these other people see this too. Uh, you've been praying for a family. If you've been praying for a house, whatever. You've been praying for this union. You've been praying for this justice. God heard your prayers are being answered. They're watching you. And they're also this group cult coven secret society. That are being watched by the Fetty Wobs. Okay. They're you're moving away from them there's also somebody trying to get you to move um to like to leave your purpose again like i said but whatever they're fucking losers um if you move they're trying to find you or they watch or watch you but whatever you're doing to progressively ra you're rapidly progressively moving you know forward you're coming out of rough waters into smooth sailing from here on out when your spiritual gifts you're a spiritual leader you're extremely gifted and you're extremely powerful you're extremely creative and you're extremely um uh, uh, fertile and whatever you're doing with your spiritual gifts, okay? They're very nervous about your, your spiritual gifts. Um, and because you walked away from these people and you're keeping your sword up is why you're single, self-sufficient, and independent and why you're moving forward, why you're coming into you and you're getting this Ace of Pentacles, all right? And it's because you're in your purpose and you're you're leaving these people behind and you're not allowing them to come back in to fuck your shit up for you. You know what I mean? You're so you you deserve it. So everything that's you know is completely over for these idiots. You're getting your justice. Your ex is telling on everybody. Um, <laughs> you're you know what I mean? And whatever this death magic was, they the spells, hexes, witchcraft, voodoo, hoodoo, whatever the fuck they were doing. Um, it's coming back to them time to them. and they they're they're scared to death and they're not and whatever it was it was something very it was something very powerful but you were just way more powerful than it and them so they're not going to be able to withstand it because they're already they you know they use up all their energy their power to do it and they're already the, all these attacks they've been sending you it hasn't been affecting you they're attacking themselves so they're already weak and beaten down and whatever they, they did conjure up something very powerful and then they're not going to be able to withstand it because it's coming back times 10 and they're hella nervous <laughs> they're watching you shaking in the boots <laughs> but i don't know that's what i have for you guys um till next time remember god loves you so do i spread love not hate always and please um do not forget to give god jesus angels ancestors loved ones that passed away oh shit look we have six here and four plus two is six and another six 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 someone's realigning their thoughts to a higher perspective but it's also somebody going straight to fucking hell because it's right underneath the devil card 
maybe got your ex that's realigning their thoughts to a higher perspective and starting to tell on everybody because they know they're caught. But they know that the devil's coming to collect your fucking soul too. <laughs> I don't know. But remember, yes, yeah, remember, please not forget to give God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, loved ones that passed away, the utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation because they're moving mountains for us, getting ready to rain down miracles on us, all right? And please, if you would like to, um, please hit that like button. Please hit share if you'd like to share. And please hit subscribe and turn the notification bell on to all. So you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And if you like to do it, you do not have to. It's not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated. The information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of with all of my heart ahead of time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so. And to everybody who has been. Thank you, thank you, thank you. May God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. And for the um super thanks and the members and everything. Thank you guys. Absolutely love yous. Um, may God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. Make sure you are subscribed, guys. Um, doing a giveaway. Make sure if you would like to try to win this Kipper deck, go on my community board, check it out, and just write in Kip, just write Kipper in the comments. And tomorrow at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'm going to pick the winner, but I am going to be double checking to make sure you are a subscriber, because it's for the subscribers only. I'm going to be doing the, um, giveaways every month, so make sure you're a subscriber, all right? At least once a month I'm going to be doing, if not more. So make sure you're a subscriber. All right. All right, guys. Thank you. And happy Easter. Clyde says happy Easter. Meow, too. And, um, yeah, we love you guys. We appreciate you guys. And thank you for all your love and support. Happy Easter. And God bless.